Yes, what's going on? It's Mex. Welcome back to Players World. Today, we're going to catch up with Jay and his Smart 2 build. Yeah, so we're back here with Jay. Um, Jay, so before, actually, before we even address this, mm. um, if you guys saw episode three where we went to JTEC, we looked around the premises and they were just finishing this off. We're going to touch on this. But first of all, you've got an amazing 964, you've got a G Wagon, you've got a uh, Cosworth 190. Where does a gold Mark II fit into? So the spectrum of the car. Um, I'm just, I've, they're, I love them. I love Mark Twos. I love Mark Ones. I've had loads of them. Um, I had one of these previous, Grandad Spec, that ran like a G60, and I just, I think it was January last year. I just got bored, and I knew this one had been for sale, and was pretty clean. And in the end, I just bought it, and yeah. I just love them. I mean, yeah, I'm a beigey, goldy Mark II for me. It's, it's obviously key. Uh, it's not shouty, it's not a GTI, it's no. not anything. It's just super understated, yeah. like really clean. Uh, but as we saw at JTEC, this isn't just a. No, obviously, it's gold. like full nut and bolt engine underneath is all either brand new or fully reconditioned. Uh, and once it's mapped, it'll be running like over 300, it's running about 240 at the moment. And it's more than enough, as you well know. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I, I like, obviously I've had GTIs, VRs, and I've done the green one was fully caged and that. Mm. But I love the fact that this is just completely standard, pretty much inside bar, gear knob and steering wheel. Um, you know, just shit interior basic and it's spastic fast yeah it, it's, it's, yeah it's it, ridiculous so talking about the fast element so what did JTEC put in there so they put in a 1.8 bam with a hybrid co4 in it down pipes quaff diff and it's all forged yeah. so if I want to go stupid turbo which I said I'd never do <laughs> but you know what you I mean know. It's built to last, but it drives, like I've had Mark IIs that have had engine transplants mm. that feel like they've had engine transplants. Yeah. This doesn't, this feels like this engine should be in this car and it doesn't squeak, it doesn't rattle, it doesn't knock, it doesn't bang. Yeah, it's faultless. I love, I literally love driving it. I will quite happily leave everything else at home and drive around in this. Yeah, I mean, I can imagine, obviously it looks great. It's such a vibe um, and with well the BAM was originally what 225 the BAM I think so yeah yeah, yeah so um, and then what so hybrid turbo and that you're easy at 250 without even really yeah without touching touch I think it. at the moment it's around that yeah. um, and Jamie's like yeah it'll make 300 plus easy and it comes on at like two and a half thousand revs and just yeah it just goes so quick yeah absolutely wild to see um, and obviously you're running rubber bands Ditch finders. <laughs> yeah, like that. Uh, yeah, yeah well, but I, mean, I can't even read the size, but it, one, they're that small. Eight, no, uh, yeah, these are one six. No, these five. are one six five thirty seventeens, yeah. and they're one eight fives on the rear. Because it's a six and a half on the front and a seven on the rear. IGSs. Yeah, I mean the the, the wheel just alone it just suits the car perfectly. I think the colour of the centres. Like, yeah, like I've so got, I had STRs mm. that were fully polished, that looked a bit too bling. Yeah. Um, and yeah, these just kind of suit that sort of understatedness of the car. Yeah, yeah, the, the, the look of it, the, the steering wheel, I, I love that. It just ties it in. Like I say, it's pretty much standard interior, in really good condition interior, by the way. It's, it's just, it's, yeah, I mean, it's done 76,000 miles. The shell. Yeah, and, and the interior, it's all yeah. factory. Yeah. Um, it's been well looked after, um, and yeah, I think you know, just the whole to use your to coin your catchphrase vibe is that it is yeah, it's just fully 
fully granddad. Yes, full granddad spec, uh, and I and I love that. And the interior's in such good conditions, no bolster. It just feels in there. It feels and it almost smells kind of like granddaddy. It yeah, just, it smells just, like old old man balls. Oh, <laughs> my it, son loves it. Thinks it's great. My wife thinks it's proper sad. Just does not get it, and she's like. What on earth are you doing? Which is the cosign that you need because if your wife loves it, then it's. Oh, I, my wife is like my sounding board. If yeah. she likes it, it's terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, unless it's handbags, shoes, yeah, yeah. or watches, I don't listen to her. And I'm not buying a lot of like handbags. Well, I am, but not for me. <laughs> um, but yeah, when it comes to cars, she's yeah, yeah, not yeah. close. Exactly. So if she hates it, yeah, then it's, it's cool. Good. Then it's yeah. cool. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah I totally Although technically, agree with that. she hates that as well. Oh, so. Weird. Yeah. Story to the nodding dog. What's the story to the nodding dog? This dogs? team Wackadackle, which is like the old school VW boys. Okay. From like back in the continent. When I bought it, mm. I said to him that the dog has to come with it. That's new totally to me. I didn't even know that. I just thought you thought it'd be funny to put a nodding dog in the back. Um, however, this uh, newspaper article from the date of the car, 1986, September 29th. Sun, of course, gotta keep it correct. And uh, August 86, Playboy magazine. So, Benthouse hat just to tie it all in. Bridget Nelson's. But there you go. Babs in there as well. Apparently, they're all in there. Can we go? No, you can't see that. We'll get kicked off YouTube. I think maybe we should take this out. Yeah, Spend. feel free. I'm not coming with you. Oh, right. Okay, perfect. So, um, Rick, let's set the cameras up. But and obviously, if you crash it, you break your buy. Yeah, you buy, and you buy me a new one, exactly as it is. You break your buy. All right. Um, so let's jump in and let's see what this supposedly T50 feels like. Mirror check, 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 check. Lights on. Yeah, that clutch a bit. Jeez, that clutch a bit jumpy. Oh, that's, that's a good shift. Oh, yes. It really wants to go, don't it? <laughs> yeah, this, this, it doesn't even like driving slowly. Mate, this is a, like, you can already feel this is, Aggressive. Fucking pedals are so tight. Not gonna let us out, are ya? Of course not. Thanks, mate. Hey, listen to that. Fuck me. Jesus! Yo, this is fucking aggressive. <laughs> Just wants to fucking rip your arms off. This is way too fucking fast for a Mark II. This is not normal. Get to 60 real quick. Get some space between us and the 50. Fucking hell. Jesus Christmas. This shoes. Is this going to be? Mate, this is fucking stressful. Mate. For a Beige Mark II, this shouldn't fucking do this. Fuck me.
This is wild. Whoa, I've got sweaty pits. Oh, oh, mate. This is an absolute weapon. Don't worry, I saw that. Let's go. Mate, this... but it drives so nice. The steering is like really direct. The car feels really, really light. Really light. Nice. It revs so fuck fast. Man, it's not all right. love this. This is absolutely mad. Hey, JTX smashed it out of the park with this. Absolutely smashed it. I just come back from taking this out for a spin. This is absolutely mad. It's such a, such a quick car. It feels so planted, so well put together. It's an amazing build. There's no way it's just 250 brake. It's gotta be over that, but I guess we'll see whenever it gets dynoed. For now, let us know what you think of the car, of the build, of the look, of the interior. Like, there's just so many aspects to this car. I love it. I love Mark IIs, and this is the best one I've ever driven, experienced, and it's savage and fast. So great build. Thanks very much for watching. Catch you next time. Actually a real cool touch, um, but yeah. Was you even born in like 86? I was two. You were two? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I was 11. I'm old. Still in fucking Mexico though, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I, I came to England in 96. So this car was 10 years old. This is, this is sick. This is a touch. I didn't know that. Um, so yeah, now you know. The more you know. If you know, you know. I-K-Y-K. Is that what it is?